Oh, really? Like He's my ride. <laughs> You're hiding the booze. Uh, <laughs> she'll give it to us later. Up next. <laughs> when we get naked. Boo -boo we'll naked. Yeah, Boo -boo Up next is one of my favorite people uh, from the good old days. Uh, not just because uh, she is uh, a member of this large amorphous network of uh, people that we used to call the spider farmers, uh, but she has the good taste to laugh at nearly every one of my jokes, and you can't put a price on that. Uh, please welcome to the stage the love slave of the Lollipop Guild, uh, <laughs> Deb. Thank you very much. So, I'm live vlogging right now. So, uh, I actually am a little taller than usual because in honor of Holly, I wore my tallest heels. I, they, these would be flats for Holly, but for me, they're, they're good. So, I am really honored to be um, here, and it was quite risky of Dawn to put me in this position because in golf standard time, this party would start at midnight. <laughs> Isn't Dawn lovely, you guys? I mean, usually Holly's attracted to brains. We call that sapiosexuality. And to be fair, usually the universe puts those brains in some funny looking packages. No offense, Dawn. <laughs> <laughs> I think with Dawn, she may have the whole package, but I really haven't known Dawn all that long, so she might just not be all that bright. So, <laughs> it's really She's nice to be your host. <laughs> And I'm glad to see that you've gotten out from behind the counter. Every other time I see Mark, he's behind the counter. Yes. At Austin Books, at Book People. I think now he sells popcorn. Yeah. So it's really, it's really great that you got out for a little bit. I have legs! I have legs! <laughs> what you guys probably don't know is that Mark is the world's foremost authority on Robert E. Howard. And I'm thinking the whole reason he started talking to Holly is because she pretty much looks like a Frisetta cover. Yes. I mean, yes. <laughs> well then, I say, I still don't want to dance. You <laughs> always ask me to dance. And uh, I don't know, somebody probably told them girls love guys that can dance, but not when it's the Foxtrot. <laughs> so, Deanne, I really have to thank you, because if it wasn't for you kidnapping me and trying to sell me at the Dallas Fantasy Fair to get your booth, I would never have met all of these wonderful people. <laughs> that said, no matter what he offers you, Bill Willingham can still not put babies in my belly. That <laughs> order is not over. Remind me to tell you that. <laughs> <laughs> oh, yeah, yeah. I'm like, my <laughs> We're here for you. <laughs> and um, I'm thankful that you're still my friend, despite my lack of punctuality and <laughs> my inability to keep the iPad on. Um, <laughs> and my short shoes. Um, it's really amazing because we go to things together. Holly is early to everything. She wants to go to a concert. She's ready at 6. She wants to be at the bar at 7. The bar doesn't even open till 9. <laughs> so when we get together, we have to average things. But she does it anyway. <laughs> so you all know Holly is a huge fan of Wonder Woman. And she's a wonder. And thank God you don't have that lasso of truth or we would all be in trouble. Um, but she has a superpower that some of you may not know about, although frankly most of you probably do. Um, it's not her shoes, it's blowjobs. And uh, she's legendary for them. And um, she once told me she got so good at them because sometimes it's just too much trouble to actually fuck a guy. So you just give him a blowjob and then you're done with that. Damn. 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 Too, which is nice. Although there's probably a few people 
I could have standed if you didn't make quite so confident. <laughs> but um, you're still the person I want to dance naked on an island with. Aww. Aww.